pi. In this video, I'll be solving equations after expanding them. Two keywords equations. I will solve them, and I'll and that's by expanding the brackets. Firstly, get your notebooks out because there's going to be a lot to learn. Now, we have two examples here. Two equations. The first one. We first expand the brackets. We expand these brackets. So by this we've seen in the previous videos we do two times s and two times four. And that will equal two s add because there's an add sign two times four eight. That equals sixteen. Now we we have to do uh, we've done this before we take away 8 0 we take away 8 8 whatever we do to the left we do to the right whatever we do to the right we do to the left okay anyway on to this we take the 2s down so 2s equals not the 0 because we've gone down to 0 now equals 8 we divide each thing by 2 because 2 is smaller than 8 that equals s and that equals 4 now if now we found out s equals 4 we've solved it really easy recap what we do is we first go 2 times s and 2 times 4 and that's by expanding expand ding the brackets first then we've got 2s 2s add 8 equals 16 we take away 8 because we do the opposite of the add sign and we do, we do whatever we do to the left we do to the right and that equals 8 and then we have the 8 here and the s we take that down we divide by 2 and that's our answer now onto this there's going to second e e equation really easy we do what we did previously we do 3 times t and 3 times 1 so 3 times t is 3t and 3 times 1 is 3 equals 18 because we take that down now to make it easier we have to add 3 opposite of this so we add 3. Whatever we do to the left, we do to the right. 21. We take that down. So something equals 21. Now, 3t, take that down, and it will equal 3t. 3t equals 21. Now, what we do is divide it by 3, which equals t. Divide that by 3, which equals 7. t equals 7. Just to recap quickly before I uh, leave you, we've done 3t. 3 times t and 3 times 1 to expand the brackets we got this now this is really good and then we have to add we do the opposite of the minus and that what we do to the left we do to the right like we said here now we t we get 21 and 3t we take them down each of them now 3t equals 21 we divide both of them and I say both of them because whatever you do to the left, you do to the right by 3. And then that will equal t. And then that will equal 7. So t equals 7 over here. And s equals 4. If you have any concerns, speak to Mr. Reddy. Thank you.